Hello, Planeswalkers, as promised, here is Opinion 69. This will make absolutely no sense if you haven't watched MTG Opinion 68. So I forgot to make the alternate point that the artist made because the way that Wizards of the Coast got caught is that they tried to have that digital artist that uses a AI um, do some kind of a modification to the artwork, change it in some way, and they didn't know how to do it. Now, the point that the artist made when he was talking is that if you're just a AI using person and you have no background in art, you haven't gone to college for art or whatever and had all that experience and training, um, you won't be able to recognize what's good artwork, make any changes for it, and he says that's why it'll go away. But I think that that's a lacking of expertise in your area. Certainly somebody who knows AI well would be able to go in and um, create a prompt that has the AI do what Watsi asked him to do. So that's a good point that there's no replacement for being a real artist and having some taste. Same thing is um, painting miniatures, because I also play Warhammer. Um, if you don't have any composition, if you choose like some wonky colors or whatever, you may be such a good artist that you can recover from that, but uh, um, maybe not because that's important too. Having a having a um, a concept of the color chart and um, the methods of artwork, whether it's done with AI or done just totally by hand, you have to have a knowledge of the methods of doing art, then um, you're certainly going to fail in uh, what your boss asks you to do. So just that additional point. Have a great day, Planeswalkers. Appreciate the views. Please subscribe. Thank you. Bye.